Alright, welcome everybody to a new video. So, um, you might be thinking right now, there's a couple, okay, first of all, there's a couple of different things. First of all, you might be really, you might be thinking, hey, wait a minute, why is Perry recording? Well, um, I just found out that our computer came pre-installed with Minecraft, I guess. It's a trial version, but, um, and I, yeah, so it's not actually full on Minecraft, it's just the trial version, but, um, I thought I'd go ahead and, we need a good video out, so I thought I'd do one on, um, bridging, on, like, how to bridge when you're on a computer, so I'm just gonna call this bridge, alright, survival, I'm gonna put it in peaceful, and, yeah, as you can see, I can't change anything, I can't turn on, you know, I can't, like, go into creative, yeah, see, um, but I'm going to go ahead and load up in the world. Um, so I'm going to have to get all these resources myself. I'm just going to use wool. I mean, not wool, sorry. Wood. And then I'll show you a couple, I think maybe five or six different ways to bridge if you are on computer. Um, yeah, like I said, we just need to get a video out. We haven't posted in a while. I apologize, but we're actually back in school now. We're not, um, in, we're not online anymore. So we're in person, school, and you know, that's been a hot bit of a hustle, but, um, yeah. Okay, I'm here, and you can see that it's a, let's let the trial begin, and I have about an hour and a half, so, start trial, and I'm in. So, I'm gonna go ahead and get wood. Uh, probably stone tools to get wood faster, and yeah, I guess begin time lapse for post production me. And that'll be time for um, what it took me to get wood. Um, I have a stack of each, not each, I guess. Um, I have a stack of birch and a stack of oak. Now for the most satisfying part. Oh yeah. Okay. So now that I have all that wood. Oh, my bad. Now that I have all that wood, I will begin showing you how to speed bridge, or sorry, just bridge in general. So I'm gonna go ahead and go up this mountain, I guess. Oh, the wolf just killed this sheep. Okay. All right. Now that I'm at the top of here, uh, I'm going to build a little platform. Now I'm assuming that you're gonna be using these bridging. Techniques, techniques if you're playing on a server such as the Hive or, you know, just any Minecraft server, really. Or maybe you just want to learn how to bridge instead of sh uh, shifting. So I'm just gonna, you know. Alright. So the first one I'm gonna show you is, you probably all know it, shifting. Right. You shift and then you. 
Well, I don't know how that happened. But, you know, you just place blocks behind you. Right, so that's the first one. Now the second one, um, I call it alternating. So I call it, that one is just shift bridging. Um, I like this one, I don't know what it's called, but I call it alternating where you place and then you walk forward, place, walk forward, and then you just alternate between the two. And it's quite a bit faster actually, especially if you get good at it, like, like that. So now that we've got that one, which um, I'm going to be rating these, uh, like, 10 being the hardest, 1 being super easy. I'd give this one like a 1. It's very easy. I'd give this one probably about a 3 because, you know, you kind of have to have um, hand-eye coordination and be coordinated for that. Um, and then I'm going to be, now I'm going to be doing speed bridging, right? So the way you do this one, now this does require a mouse that you can click and hold down the button, like hold down and then you don't have to keep pressing it. Um, not everybody has a mouse that can do that. I don't know why, to be honest, because I can click and hold down and place blocks, but my friend, Emery, she can't, right? But anyway, so you look at the block that you want to be placing on, and you sprint, and you place the block. Oh, my bad. You run at it while holding the block, right? And you, you're still sprinting, and you're holding down the place button, and you jump up. Oh, I'm not a computer player, in case you can't, you guys can't tell, but... Like I was saying, the way you do this is you run at it and you place a block, and then you jump up, and then you can normally just be able to hold down the button. Now, ah, this does take a bit more um, practice because you have to, like, your timing basically has to be perfect for this in order for it to work, and in case you can't tell, I don't really have that. Ah, I started to get it. Anyway, so I'd give that one probably about a 6 out of 10, because it's quite, it's pretty difficult. You actually have to, like, pay attention, you know, and, like, try to get it all perfect. So the next one, um, you can't actually do on computer, or you can, it's just very hard. It's, um, It's a uh, jump bridging, so I guess you might be able to do it on a computer actually. So you do that is you have to have one, two, three blocks, right? And then place it on your first block, right? Now you sprint and um, hold down the place button at the same time, and then you look straight down immediately and start jumping, right? Just immediately start jumping and keep holding down the place button, and then all of a sudden you have a you have a bridge. Um, I'm actually going to rate this one a 5 out of 10 for um, difficulty because I find it easier than the one where you like look straight and then, you know, I find it easier than that one for some reason. Uh, there we go. Uh, but yeah, so you just look straight down, place a block, look forward, um, place it and look, and uh, yeah, hold down the place button and you can just kind of looks like you're using scaffolding. Uh, so I'm going to see what that looks like. And, oh. I guess we'll see what that looks like in... Or we won't. Okay, hang on. Give me a second, guys. I want to see what that... I want to see what that looks like when you're in, like, third person. So I'm just going to come up here. And I do have one more to show you. Um, and it's quite difficult. And I don't know if I can actually do it. So. Yeah, it looks like you're using like scaffolding. Or like some bridging. Uh, hack. So the last one. I, that one's called jump bridging. Uh, you know. Super, uh, super easy. If once you like figure out how to do it. Not like that. It's super easy. So. Um, again, that one does require you to does require you to have a uh, be able to hold down the place button. Now, I don't know why that is. I mean, if you're on Switch or like PS4 or Xbox, it's going to be a lot easier because 
you know, there's triggers that you can just hold down. Um, and this last one is called Ninja Bridging. And I... The thing that Dream does, let's just say that, alright. You... Sh oh my gosh, you shift. Okay, that's not shifting. You shift, and then you place a block behind you. And right as you get to it, you unshift. You unshift. Um... So basically, it speeds up the process, and it's called ninja bridging. Uh, I'm not sure why, but I can't do it. And that one is quite fast, but that one requires like I'd say nine out of ten diff uh, technique, because I obviously cannot do it because I have not been on computer for long enough. Um, so yeah, guys, I uh, just thought I'd make a quick little video about like bridging like if you're on like the hive or something you know you know or sky wars and you just like oh like it's a noob oh, oh i'm doing it oh anyway so yeah i'm just gonna do a quick little of each of them or not anyway i guess that's a good place to leave off the video um yeah, guys, sorry we haven't uploaded in a while. Like I said, we're just getting back into school. And, um, so yeah, I thought I'd just make a quick little video about um, bridging, different bridging techniques uh, for you guys. So in the case, you know, you're like, man, I'm stuck doing the shift bridge, you know. Unless you're doing ninja bridging, then props to you because I can't do that. You know. So, uh, I think that's where I'm going to end off the video. Thank you guys for watching. Um, if you did, I'll see if I can make one about for mobile but in the in the future, but I don't think I can because, first of all, I don't have Minecraft on mobile, and um, I'll have to figure out a way to screen record. But, if you, regardless, if you guys enjoyed, please like if you liked, and subscribe if you want to, you know, only about, uh, I think it's... 35% of our viewers are actually subscribed, which isn't doesn't seem like a lot, you know, but it, it kind of is, and, you know, why not? So, but of course you don't have to. Anyway, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, please be sure to uh, share the video with your friends, and hopefully you found this uh, useful. So, yeah, see ya.